Hi guys, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Today I'm going to be talking about scientists and why they are very important community helpers. So, you might be wondering what do scientists do and how do they help the community? Well, first we're going to talk about what they do. Scientists observe the world around them. They study plants, rocks, bones, animals, viruses and bacteria, pollution to the human body, and more. So, they do research experiments to discover new things and find solutions to problems. So now, you also might be wondering, again, how do scientists help the community? Scientists help the community by, let me show you. So it says, scientists discover vaccines and cures for diseases. They also find ways to help the environment by making solar panels, electric cars, and other environmentally friendly, friendly energy sources. So here are some of my favorite scientists. Thomas Edison, because he was sitting down and he created the light bulb. It took him 500 he had 5,000 mistakes, and finally he made it. So, if you ever feel like giving up, do not give up. Try 5,000 more times, no matter how hard it seems. Sir Isaac Newton. He sat under an apple tree one day. An apple fell on his head. And he thought to himself, Why is that? What brings the apple down on my head? Why didn't it float up in the sky? So, he discovered gravity. Albert Einstein, my favorite one. As you can see, he is very silly. And Albert Einstein studied very, very important things like speed of light and energy. But even he was like four years old and he didn't know how to talk. Can you believe that? He even like, nobody even like thought he was going to be good at anything and he ended up to be like one of the best scientists so he's also a very very important scientist and as you can see here this guy you scientists sometimes work in a lab they work in the laboratory sometimes they work by themselves like this guy on the picture sometimes they work in two or a little bit more and here are some of the materials scientists use thermometer scale microscope microscope zooms in on the bacteria and viruses and they can look at all the like cells and study them a little bit closer so technology and uh, they use technology to find their research some of the research that they do and they use it that because it helps when they need research they can look at the technology and look it up so here's some test tubes the telescope most important of all none of you forget this don't just remember that record what you found in research it could be on your ipad phone whatever sketch or whatever just record it so the world can hear about it and then you can like share your information with the world and they can gain knowledge and you can be a little more famous so why did i put up coronavirus on here somebody tell me why because why right now in the world why am i here at, why am i over here why am I not in my classroom? I could be presenting this in my classroom while I'm on video. Literally, it's because of coronavirus. It's spreading and it's killing people. And the only people who can help with it is scientists, guys. Scientists are very, very important. So here is, and scientists make all sorts of cures for all bacteria. So if you're just wondering what the, sci the scientists that 
make the cure for coronavirus, they're called, um, what's it called? Epi. Epidemiologists. Yes. So, those, and there are many more scientists, don't get me wrong about that. <laughs> but right now I put up corona because it's like really painful. And a lot of people die from it, especially in China. So, bye and don't forget Remember what I said, like, subscribe, comment about what video you want me to make next. I'm also going to make a Porsche 9-11 one. Lego. So, uh, yeah, Lego. So, bye. And watch that one too, it's good.